Hold up. When it comes to women wrestlers to watch, Liv Morgan's name should be on everyone's list, is a future leader of WWE's women's division. Liv Morgan made her main roster debut as a member of the Riot Squad, then branched out on her own. Currently, Morgan is on the Raw roster, where she's getting a chance to shine. Liv Morgan has long shown promise in WWE. Since making her official in-ring debut back in 2015, she has proven herself to be a capable, talented performer who has a strong connection with the WWE Universe. Unfortunately, she has mostly found opportunities hard to come by. First being used as enhancement talent, and then being mismanaged both as part of the Riot Squad, and as a single star that may be about to change though, as Morgan recently established herself as the number one contender to Becky Lynch's Raw Women's Championship. While she failed to win the gold, this was a strong indication of the fact that WWE recognizes Liv Morgan as something special. There's no doubt that her time will come, and when it does, fans will want to know a lot more about her. As Morgan's popularity grows, she's gaining more fans. As with all WWE stars, fans are curious to know tidbits about their favorite wrestlers. So, without further ado, let's take a look at Morgan's age, height, relationship status, and other interesting facts about the rising young star. Number 10. She briefly worked as Marley. Most wrestlers usually have a couple of in-ring names before they find the one that sticks, and Liv Morgan was no different. When she made her in-ring debut in November 2015, Liv Morgan worked under the name of Marley. The match was nothing special, as she was just a jobber designed to get Eva Marie over. On the December 2nd episode of NXT, she returned to programming, this time as Liv Morgan, and the name has stuck ever since. Number 13. She had a rough upbringing. A number of wrestlers who make it to the big leagues confess to having rough upbringings, and that adversity ultimately led them to the squared circle. Morgan grew up alongside five siblings, all of whom were cared for by their single mother. Morgan mentioned that money was often tight in her household, so her family couldn't afford cable. There were also instances, where Liv found it immensely difficult to buy herself new clothes. Number 12. She had to wait over a year for her first WWE win. Debuting as Liv Morgan, didn't bring a reversal of fortunes with it. For a long time, Liv Morgan was used as an enhancement talent, putting over other wrestlers, WWE viewed as more valuable to the company. Morgan had signed a contract with WWE back in 2014, but had to wait till the summer of 2016 for her first win in the company, beating Aaliyah in singles competition. She would defeat, Rachel Fazio a week later, before being decimated by Asuka in under a minute. Number 11. She's been ordained. It's a little unclear why she decided to do this, but Liv Morgan is an ordained minister. She took to her Instagram account to share the news back in 2016. These certificates don't really expire, so it is safe to assume that she still remains ordained. All of this is a little ironic, considering Liv Morgan returned to programming after an extended time away from programming to break up Bobby Lashley, and Lana's wedding in a storyline everyone would rather pretend never happened. Number 10. She's 27 years old and born on June 8, 1994. At 27 years old and born on June 8, 1994 Morgan is one of the youngest female wrestlers on WWE's roster. Morgan's journey in WWE started seven years ago when, at the age of 20, she signed with NXT. Morgan's had a pretty good career so far, and at her age, she still has a lot to accomplish in the world of wrestling. With the proper push, the young woman can one day be a women's champion. Number 9. She's 5'3". At 5 feet 3 inches, Liv Morgan is a few inches shorter than the rest of the women's roster, whose heights range from 5 feet 5 inches to 6 feet. Although Liv Morgan may be short, she has a big attitude. Morgan has shown she's one tough lady who doesn't let anyone boss her around. While many ladies may have a height advantage, Morgan's not afraid to take on taller and bigger opponents. Number 8. She used to work as a Hooters waitress. Before hitting it big in the wrestling industry, Morgan worked a regular job. The New Jersey native was a Hooters waitress before being discovered by a WWE talent scout. This bit of news was unknown by wrestling fans until old photos of Morgan's waitressing days began to surface. 
A series of selfies showing Morgan in her orange and white Hooters outfit gained attention. Morgan has come a long way since her Hooters girl days. Number 7. She's dating Bo Dallas. It's not uncommon for wrestlers to date each other. Throughout the years, there have been many couples who met thanks to WWE. One of the most recent and surprising pairs is Liv Morgan and her new boyfriend Bo Dallas. Nobody knew they were a couple until February 2021 when the news broke. It's unknown how long the two have been together. However, they're currently living together on a farm, and have started a side business as real estate agents. Number 6. She previously dated Enzo Amore. Long before she became romantically involved with Bo Dallas, Liv Morgan dated another WWE star. Liv Morgan and Enzo Amore began dating during their days in NXT, yet by 2017, the couple had called it quits. As for the reason for the split, Morgan implied on social media that her ex was unfaithful. The two apparently didn't part on good terms. Amore has thrown shade at Morgan in his rap songs. Meanwhile, Morgan chooses to ignore her ex's antics. Number 5. Famous for her blue tongue. Early on during Liv Morgan's run on the main roster, fans took notice of her. But it wasn't her athleticism or her personality that stood out, it was her blue tongue. Morgan's blue tongue became synonymous with her character. As it turns out, the gimmick started by pure accident. According to Morgan, she and Ruby Riot were eating candy prior to a match on Raw. Morgan's candy of choice happened to be a blue Jolly Rancher. Although Morgan didn't face any reprimand for her blue tongue, Riot got into trouble due to her orange tongue from a Tic Tac. Number 4. She's friend with Lana. In December 2019, WWE's most bizarre wedding occurred with the marriage of Lana and Bobby Lashley. Of course, there were interruptions from Lana's ex Rusev, which was unexpected. However, things took a weird turn when Morgan revealed she was in love with Lana. The two ladies would then embark on a short feud, which saw Morgan come out as the victor. Although Morgan and Lana were enemies on screen, in real life they're best of friends. The two women can often be seen spending time together outside of the ring. Lana's made a few trips to Morgan's farm, and Morgan's made appearances on Lana's YouTube channel. Number 3. She's a Disney fanatic. Many WWE stars such as Alexa Bliss are huge Disney fans. As it turns out Morgan is also on the list of Disney fanatics in pro wrestling. Morgan's love of Disney includes a collection of Disney memorabilia, including plush dolls. Morgan used one of her Stitch stuffed animals during an NXT Halloween contest, in which she dressed as a baby. Although Morgan's work schedule keeps her busy, in her downtime she loves to visit Disney World. Number 2. She was featured on Total Divas. The show Total Divas features the lives of WWE's women wrestlers in and out of the ring. During season 9 of the reality series, casting changes included the additions of Ronda Rousey and Sonya Deville. Morgan also made appearances throughout the season, however, she was viewed more as a supporting character than a main cast member. But that didn't stop Morgan from participating in adventures with her co-workers. Morgan embarked on a girl's trip to Maui, where Brie and Nikki Bella surprised her with a visit from Morgan's mother. Number 1. She's close with her former Riot Squad members. In November 2017, Morgan, Sarah Logan, and Ruby Riot made their main roster debut as the Riot Squad. Although the group was heels, fans couldn't help but love the trio in real life. Morgan's bond with Logan and Riot was just as tight in real life as it was on screen. Although the group eventually disbanded, and Logan and Riot were released by WWE, Morgan keeps in touch with her friends. Morgan has visited Logan and her newborn son numerous times. Recently, when Ruby debuted in AEW, Morgan was one of the first to take to social media to congratulate her pal. Oh, let me up with a bright smile on now To me in the dark, I won't get lost now To the moonlight, I